What is up my friends? This is Jeff Benjamin with iDownloadBlog. I want to show you Badger for iOS 7. Now we've reviewed Badger before in the past. Uh, this is a tweak that allows you to interact with notifications by swiping up on an app icon to view its notifications. So you can swipe up or there's an option in the settings to uh, change that swipe up to a double tap. And then from there you can interact with that notification by swiping horizontally. You can open the app associated with the notification just like that. Uh, in some cases like with the messages app you can actually reply uh, to a notification from the badger interface uh, the only problem well there's actually multiple problems but the main problem I have with this tweak is that it just is a little clunky um, it doesn't really fit in with the workflow very well it kind of feels forced on you and it, it doesn't really feel like it's improving the notifications experience in any real way and I hate to say that because the developer of Badger is a cool guy. And, um, you know, I just hate to, you know, have negative things to say about his release. But at the same time, I'm always trying to tell you guys straight. I'm always trying to just keep it, keep it real with you guys and not sugarcoat things just because I like a developer. Um, and you can see that you can access notifications for pretty much every app, although every app does not have notifications there. Now here is with the messages. If I swipe over there, you can actually interact and reply to a message. Now you'll notice the problem here is that you don't have any context uh, to, the, to the message when you reply to it. It's just a little pop-up box with a little input box for you to type your reply. It doesn't actually show you what you're replying to. Now here are the settings for Badger. You have the invocation method. You can change that from a swipe up to a double tap. There are some other, uh, uh, you know, interface settings that you can change, the visual settings, like enabling a thick line uh, for Badger. You see the thicker line there. Um, you can also pull down to refresh your notifications. Uh, but just the overall experience, folks, it, it just isn't there. Uh, it feels a little forced upon you. It feels a little half-baked, well, or a lot half-baked, actually. Um, and it just doesn't feel like it improves anything with regard to notifications. Not really. I mean, it just feels more so of a chore to use this. Uh, now there is one nice little feature here, which is the roll up. It, it features all of your notifications in one little place. But the problem is that even with messages, you cannot interact with them. So you can't even reply from this uh, roll up. You can only open the associated application just like that. So that's a little disappointing, but that's pretty much the whole theme of this week. Um, it's just a lot of features, but there really isn't any true benefit to them that I can find. Perhaps you'll disagree. Perhaps you love Badger. Um, I do like the developer, like I was stating, but for $1.49, I just don't really see um, any true real world usefulness to this jailbreak tweak. It just lacks the functionality um, and it just lacks the cohesiveness that's required to have a tweak uh, that is beneficial to you. So you guys let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Again, Badger is available right now on Cydia's Big Boss Repo for $1.49. Let me know what you think in the comments. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.